Welcome to the Multiplication Course. My name is Steve Wyborny, and this is Multiplication Motion Challenge number nine. In this video, I'm going to challenge you to move some ideas around right in front of you. Since this isn't the first motion challenge, we are going to move directly into the activity. If you didn't see the first motion challenge and aren't sure what to do, then I encourage you to go back and watch Multiplication Motion Challenge number one before watching this video. Okay, let's prepare the materials and then we can begin. You will need a pencil and a piece of paper that you can tear into some small pieces. Pause the video so you can gather those supplies. Tear off small pieces like these and on those pieces write 4 times 7 is equal to 28 and draw a line on this one so we can show fractions. Pause the video until your pieces are ready. Let's begin. Remember, I'm going to go through a sequence, and I challenge you to follow along with your pieces. Move the pieces the same way that I move the pieces on the screen. And you can pause the video at any point if you want to rearrange the pieces. 4 times 7 is equal to 28. That means I know two ideas. 7 times 4 is equal to 28, and 4 times 7 is equal to 28. It also means that 28 is equal to 4 times 7, and I know that 28 is equal to 7 times 4 because 28 is equal to 4 times 7. I'll slide away the symbols is equal to and times. And I'll bring in the triangle. Then I'll take a moment to rearrange the pieces on the triangle so they look like this. 4 times 7 is equal to 28. I know that 7 times 4 is equal to 28 because 4 times 7 is equal to 28. Now tap the pieces. 4 times 7 is equal to 28, which means that 28 divided by 7 is equal to 4. And if 7 times 4 is equal to 28, that means 28 divided by 4 is equal to 7. Now I'll move the triangle away. Here is another relationship. 28 is 4 times greater than 7 and 28 is 7 times greater than 4. Let's rearrange the pieces again. 28. Now let's create a fraction. This shows 28 divided by 4 is equal to 7. Let's tap the pieces to show that. 28 divided by 4 is equal to 7. So the fraction 28 fourths is equal to 7. We also know that 28 divided by 7 is equal to 4. Let's tap all the pieces to show that. 28 divided by 7 is equal to 4. That means the fraction 28 sevenths is equal to 4. Now let's slide this piece out of the way. 28 is equal to 7 times 4, which means that 28 is equal to 4 times 7, and that completes the challenge. Remember that there are four levels to this challenge. If you want to do it on your own, simply pause to learn more or watch video number one for a deeper explanation. This is the Multiplication Course. My name is Steve Wyborny, and this is Multiplication Motion Challenge number nine.